I'm Tom Haig. We live here, right here at uh, Eden Valley, Minnesota. I farm with my son, Nathan. We uh, farm uh, corn and soybeans, uh, 1,900 acres, uh, 1,100 acres of corn, and about 800 acres of soybeans. My grandfather started this in 1916. My folks moved back to this farm in 1955. I was on this farm from 55 until uh, 2012. Now Nathan lives here, and uh, my wife and I live about uh, six minutes away, and uh, makes it still perfect where uh, it's close enough for me to still have an easy trip to come to the farm every day and do our work. Every year is a different opportunity to do something. You never know what Mother Nature is going to bring us. And you know, you're not doing the same thing every day. I, I enjoy farming. I enjoy the spring a lot, but the fall is the best when uh, you're bringing in that crop that you uh, saw grow all summer long and uh, you see the benefits of what you did over the course of the year to, uh, to be at the end. And it, the fall is, is my favorite time of the year. I started out just an average farmer who all of a sudden got involved with uh, Minnesota corn growers and saw some passion there to move on to uh, get into leadership at Minnesota, move on to leadership to become a board member of NCGA, and all of a sudden then just saw that, hey, I can do this as a president. I could be that person. And one of the things that I'm doing is for uh, help of my son Nathan and uh, my grandchildren for the fifth and sixth generations to keep this farm going. During my presidency, I'd like to see that uh, we continue to work hard with the higher blends of ethanol. And we have one right now with, uh, it's uh, in the House and the Senate side is the, the Next Gen's Fuel Act, which would increase ethanol up to a 30% blend into the gasoline. That uh, is a very important, that uh, gives us more grind. One of the things that we have coming this year, we have a new farm bill that Congress is gonna be looking at. On that, we're gonna make sure that crop insurance is our number one priority to be taken care of. That is very important for the farmers. As a new president, I'd like to see that we're all in that all the states are on the same page, working for the same things. There is nothing that we cannot do.